A Kelsey brother announces his retirement and Kate Middleton was finally spotted after weeks of speculation. Hi, welcome back to A Quick Look, a pop culture show where I'll be taking you through the biggest headlines in entertainment and current events. I'm Zoe Jewell, and yes, I got bangs. <laughs> okay, let's get into the show, bangs aside. Number one story we have to talk about today, and honestly, if you would have told me a year ago that this would be like the lead story in a pop culture show, I would have laughed in your face. But honestly, it's probably the biggest story that happened yesterday. Jason Kelsey, Philadelphia Eagles legend, has announced his retirement from the NFL after 13 incredible seasons. If you were online yesterday, saw on Twitter, social media, one of the most emotional, heartfelt retirement speeches I've ever seen. I mean, genuinely, I, who was not an Eagles fan at all, couldn't stop crying watching this speech. Obviously, Jason Kelsey, older brother of Travis Kelsey, who is dating Taylor Swift. We've talked about this constantly on, on this show. And I think, you know, Jason's always been a beloved player in the NFL, a legend, as I said. People have always respected him. He's, he's I think, has, has always been a fan favorite, but it certainly hasn't hurt the fact that he's sort of gotten even more popular over the last year or so because of his brother's relationship. And so many Taylor Swift fans, it was actually hilarious how many Taylor Swift fans were on social media saying things like, you know, Travis Kelsey decides to give Taylor Swift a friendship bracelet and I'm here on a Monday afternoon crying over <laughs> a Philadelphia Eagles player retirement video. Like, it's just crazy how everything trans transpired. But as I mentioned, Jason officially, officially announced his, his retirement in a very, I mean, super emotional speech that he gave um, with his family in attendance, his parents, his brother Travis was there, his wife Kylie was there. And guys, I mean, I'm going to read some of what he said and, and talked about, especially um, towards Travis, but I would highly, highly recommend you, if you haven't seen his speech, to go and find it on the internet because it will make you cry. It, it, it is just beautiful. Honestly, this is a man, I think both Kelsey brothers, but Jason really wears his heart on his sleeve. He is not afraid to be uh, emotional. I mean, he cries, basically sobs through this entire speech, thanking his parents, thanking Kylie, his wife, Philadelphia Eagles organization. I mean, just beautiful, beautiful stuff. But I do want to read what he said about Travis. And I'm going gonna, I'm, I'm gonna to read some of his quotes, but as I said, you, you got to go find it on the internet because um, I won't have the emotion that Jason had when, when he said this. So here's what he said about Travis. Quote, we have a small family, no cousins, one aunt, one uncle. It was really my brother and I our whole lives. We did almost everything together, Com competed, fought, laughed, cried, and learned from each other. We won countless Super Bowls in our minds before ever leaving the house. And when we weren't playing, we were at each other's, we were at one another's games, but seated in, in a lawn chair or a bench, a Capri Sun in our hand that mom had packed, cheering during the game and waiting outside afterward to celebrate a victory together or offer encouragement after a defeat. There is no chance I'd be here without the bond Travis and I share. It made me stronger, tougher, smarter, and taught me the values of cooperation, loyalty, patience, and understanding. It's only too poetic I found my career being fulfilled in the city of brotherly love. I knew that relationship all too well. Cue the tears. I mean, so great, so sweet. I just, I loved it. People did notice that Travis was wearing some friendship bracelets at the, um, retirement speech, one of them said something, we, we couldn't see the full bracelet, but one said something like Travis Kelsey is, it seemed to be. And then the other, I think people thought looked like it had a T and then a heart and then an, a, another T. So people assume it's for Taylor and Travis. So kind of a cute little nod to Tay. Um, but yeah, as I mentioned, go find the speech on the internet. You will not be disappointed. Even if you're not a football fan, just it's just going to hit you right in the in the heart and you will love it. 
Okay, moving on to another story. I talked about it last week. Where in the world is Kate Middleton? What's going on with her? What's happening? Why hasn't she been spotted? Well, Kate Middleton has been spotted. So TMZ got a photo of Kate Middleton that they ran Monday afternoon of Kate in a car alongside her mother right outside um, Windsor Castle, I believe. Kate was in the passenger side. Now, we don't have proof of this, okay? So this is all speculation that I'm about to say, but I, de- I've, I, I believe that this photo was definitely staged. <laughs> I think there... I think because of all the speculation over the last handful of weeks and people wondering what's going on with her, is she okay? Where has she been? I feel like the royal family wanted to put out a little crumb for people to be like, see, she's fine. She's around, she's with her mom, like it's all good. What's interesting is apparently the royal press is not running with this photo. They're not sharing it. They're not printing it um, out of quote respect for her and this whole, situation, which is kind of interesting because I feel like when has the press, especially in England, been like respectful of the royal family? That's kind of interesting. But a lot of uh, American publications have published the photo. What's funny, though, is that even even though there is this photograph out there, people still think it's fake. People feel like it's a wax figure of Kate Middleton, that it's a stand-in for Kate Middleton because the photo is very fuzzy and you, it's not like a very clear picture. Um, people still think she's hiding something, um, that maybe she had some sort of work done. I mean, the speculation is still running rampant. I don't. I think the photo maybe helps a little bit to sort of quiet the super crazy speculation that's going on, but it's almost created its own other set of rumors and think pieces um, just because of the photo itself, which is kind of interesting. I don't know. I'd be curious if you guys have seen the photo um, and if you've analyzed it, what you think. Um, So yeah, that's kind of it for today. Those are the stories. I would love to know if you have seen Jason Kelsey's speech, Let me know how many times you cried because I think I cried maybe three or four times, but I would love to know what you guys thought of it. And then also the Kate Middleton of it all. What's going on there? Should we be concerned still? Are things okay? Let me know in the comments. As always, make sure to subscribe to our channel, follow us on social media, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye.